Using a 4x4 area as a recognizable desired coverage area for a grow light, we took a 4x4 foot piece of pegboard and then centered a standard 1000 watt HPS light reflector over the board at 20 inches above that board representing the top of the plant canopy. We then built a track so we could slide our PAR meter from end to end, side to side, and diagonally, and then took measurements every 12 inches in all directions. We took the center measurement, its highest intensity, and calculated the percentage drop off from the center point. We then did the same thing for our iGrow 400 watt light. So here's the data. At 20 inches above the canopy, the HID at the center point hit 1022 par. Left to right at the first 12 inches away from the center point, it went down to 580 par. That's a 43% drop. And another 12 inches away at the outer end of the four foot area, it went down to 136 par, a drop of 87% from the center point. The iGro light at six inches above the canopy at the center point hit 1,045 par. Left to right, at the first 12 inches away from center, it hit 1,001 par, less than 4% reduction. At another 12 inches away from center, at the outer end of the four foot area, it went down to only 580 par, and that's only 45%. We did the same test side to side, and iGro outperformed the HID at every 12 inch marker. To see the full story, go to the iGrow Lights YouTube channel.